from Russia's mercenary group Wagner is back in the news. The Russian President Vladimir Putin met one of the most senior former commanders of the Wagner group and during the meeting Putin discussed the tactics of using volunteer units in the Ukraine war. Putin met Andrei Troshev, a former Wagner commander, the Russian Deputy Defense Minister Yunus Bek, um, Yevgurov uh, was also present at this meeting. According to the Kremlin, Troshev uh, now works at the Russian Defense Ministry. You have been fighting for over a year in one of those units. You know what it is, how it is done. You know about the issues that need to be resolved in advance so that the combat work goes in the best and most successful way. The meeting comes after several experts predicted an uncertain path for the mercenary group after the death of its leader Yevgeny Prigozhin and the failed mutiny in June. This also suggests that now the remaining task of the Wagner might be overseen by Troshev and Yevkorov. Earlier, the UK's military intelligence wing said hundreds of former Wagner fighters had likely started to redeploy in Ukraine. Meanwhile, the U.S. Abrams tanks have reached uh, troops at Ukraine's eastern front. Soldiers say this will help them to boost firepower in the battle. Uh, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky also confirmed the delivery of its first shipment of the Abrams tanks. It would be good to have more ammunition and firearms, tanks, artillery, jets and more manpower because there are wounded and killed among the infantry.